Hey YouTube, I have a Milwaukee M12 hatchet chainsaw and a Milwaukee M18 chainsaw and I needed to sharpen them. And according to Home Depot, you need a 4.5 millimeter file. And I could not find one at either Home Depot or my local hardware store. So I bought these on Amazon and I will put a link in the description. I also have a replacement chain for the big one, which is an Oregon R56. And I have a replacement chain for the little one, which is a Milwaukee... Who knows what. If I can find links to these, I'll put them in the description. First, I want to sharpen this one because I hit a rock yesterday. To do that, I'm going to put it in my, my vise. Now, what I like to do is mark the tooth that I'm going to start on. So my chain is awfully loose. I've got to tighten my chain. So to do that, you do this. You loosen that bolt and you tighten this. And now this is still loose, so I'm going to... That's better. Surprise this came loose. That's much better. Right there. Put this back in. Okay, well, I might as well do the big one. This is, this is pretty loose too. This is a royal pain in the ass to get out. And the only way I can do it in the woods is to take a stick and pry it out. And I don't really want to do this with my good file, so I'm going to use an old file and pry that out. Okay, that's a lot better. Let me pop a battery in, make sure it turns. Now, where was I? By the way, both of these saws are absolutely fabulous. This is good for big things, and this is fabulous for easy to carry and do little trim work on the trails or around the house. This little saw does not hold much oil, so you have to be very careful when filling it. I think that's about all it's going to take. I don't know if you can see that, but the level is full. The bigger saw takes a lot of oil. And it's full, so I don't need any. Okay, we're ready to go. Did you hear the word go? Okay, here's the tree I want to cut out of the trail and going to be a bit of work and it's just starting to rain. Okay, my battery has overheated, which is a problem I have with these high output batteries. So, see how that's going crazy? So, when I come out in the woods, I make sure I bring extra batteries. And I have two.
another battery and this one has cooled off to the showing bars but still pretty warm to the touch so on to the third battery now let's play with a little saw see how it works So one thing I love to use this saw for is cutting back brush on the trail. Right here we have a, a bit of a corner and these trees are encroaching on the... Encroaching on the corner. These branches are encroaching on the trail too. What I like to do is come way over to the actual come over to the actual tree and cut them down so that now it's a clear view. Now this tree has got a whole shitload of trees growing all together. And I think I'm gonna take them all out. These are too big to take out with loppers. Okay, so now it's going to be a long time before that needs to be cleared out again, instead of doing just a little bit at a time.